Hi, I'm Imogen. I'm in my third year and I study global arts and natural sciences. And my name's Luke Trainer. I study MSc Mental Health. Um, I've been president of Beat UIB this past year, so I've been doing quite a bit of work to raise money and awareness for Beat uh, and the work that they do. So I'm a student in long term recovery from addiction, and uh, with the help of my colleague Dr. Ed Day, we've set up the Better Than Well Collegiate Recovery Program here at the University of Birmingham. It's the first of its kind in Europe. It's, it's a, a kind of large growing phenomenon in the United States. So what that is, is a, uh, a community on campus of people in recovery from addiction, not just substance addiction, so behavioral addictions like gambling as well. And we, we come together in peer support and mutual aid to support one another on our academic journeys. Um, we found that, that people in recovery from addiction uh, have a real kind of commitment and drive for education and supporting um, one another. We have peer support groups on campus, we have sober social activities, we have meditation and dharma classes, we have a 12-step recovery group on campus, again the first of its kind in Europe. So it's a really pioneering project uh, and one that the university is, is very proud of and we're very proud to be part of. I was really surprised when I was nominated that you know, people were recognising the work that we put in. Um, yeah, I was really grateful. It was a, it was a quite an emotional thing. I was I was very um, very happy to to be recognised um, that that people in recovery on campus are noticed and that you know, it was a very difficult journey for me. I was homeless uh, before I came to the University of Birmingham, so. You know, it's been a very kind of long journey and to be recognised at some point that, that people know uh, that, that people have kind of seen that journey uh, was a really affirming and, and uh, emotional thing. I think just getting Pete's name out there, just to spread the message. Um, I really hope that it shows um, that you know recovery and education um, together is possible, uh, and that, that people who may have come from um, more difficult backgrounds or gone through some difficult stuff in their life can not only make it at university, uh, but but can be kind of visible uh, in, in such an important event for Birmingham as the Commonwealth Games. Uh, well, I will actually be working um, as a to see an athlete. <laughs> I'd say track and field, um, so yeah, uh, that the, the kind of the classic uh, 100 metres and sprint events, um, but yeah, very much track and field events are the main event for me.